everybody, today I'll be showing you 10 of the best scratch hacks. Number 1 is the stop sign detector. So we all know of the green flag detector. That's basically when green flag clicked. But there is no when stop sign clicked. So, how do we do it? Well, it's actually pretty simple. So, we're going to do one click forever, reset the timer. And the timer is running even if the project isn't running. So, if the timer is bigger than zero, that means it has not been reset, and that means the project is not on. So, let's just do when timer is bigger than zero. Think, hmm. Stop the project start it and now when i stop it it works number two is how to get extra sprites so we all know of the sprite library when you go on choose a sprite we have a vast array of sprites but did you know that there are some hidden sprites so for example if you search up witch here you will only get this witch sprite but go to the costume editor and search a witch you will get this hidden witch sprite that's not in the sprite library but it is in the custom library so that is really cool number three is how to delete a random item of a list so what we need first is a list we're going to make one and let's just name it subscribe now we have this delete one of subscribe and we have delete all of subscribe now we don't want to delete everything so get rid of this one and here if we try to type anything that is not a number it won't work so we need one of the most useful and underrated blocks in scratch the join block delete the second circle and in the first one write random now let's just make a couple of items so the first one will be sub right and now so let's see as you can see the random one this time is right and then if we do it again sub was deleted and finally now so this is a really cool block for number four we are moving into the art editor so if you want to select everything on the screen hold down control and then a and everything will be selected even if something is off screen like this it will be selected now for number five i'm going to show you how to select slash deselect something so when you have these four scratch cans selected just hold down shift and choose which one you want to deselect. So I'm just going to click on the middle one. And now it's not part of the selection anymore. And we can click on it again to make it join. Now for number 6, let's move on to some bitmap hacks. So let's imagine you're on the backdrops and you have just chosen this really nice background. But you don't really like it being white. So you decide to change the color, but as you can see, that would be really inefficient, like coloring in every white space. What you should be doing is holding down shift, going to the color you want to be gone, and then everything on screen, which was the same color, will turn into the color you wanted. And let's just say you want like some specific ones to stay, you can just do that manually and it will save you a lot of time. For number 7, I'm going to show you how to make a thumbnail. So just make a new sprite, call it thumbnail and just do the thumbnail you want. So I'm going to do white background with some black text. So now go to the code and say when clicked go to x0 y0 so it is centered and then forever show and go to front layer now what happens is we can't actually see the project and that's not what you want at all so get out the set and we're going to set ghost effect to 100 now you might be asking, but doesn't that just hide it? Well, if the project is not running, then it's not going to work. So let's just put it here. As you can see, when I click it, it's gone. When I click the stop sign, it's back. So that's really cool. And let's test it out. We just have to save it and go to our folder. And as you can see, we have this 
thumbnail. Now you might have noticed that this text isn't really looking that great. And the other options, they're not a lot better. So basically what you need to do is open up Google Drawings and then get out a text box. Then you can choose whatever font you want. I am just going to choose Comforto. Then type what you want. So the same thing, I'm going to say subscribe. Now all you need to do is file then download and download as the scalable vector graphics and SVG so it will come up as a vector. Now you can just open this on scratch. You have your really cool font. For number 9 I'm going to show you how to feature an unshared project. So first of all share the project you want to feature then go to your second tab, go to your profile, change feature project and leave it like that. Then go back and unshare it. Now you can click on OK and we have our unshared project that is featured and if anybody else clicks on it, it will just say that this project was not found. For number 10, I will show you how to get custom key combinations. So go to your extensions and choose Makey Makey and now we have this when and then whatever you want, press an order. But we can't actually choose it, we have to choose it from this list. And this is where our best friend, the join block, comes back again. So, get the join block out, delete the second circle, and in the first one, write what you want. So, I'm going to write Steam, and there needs to be space in between every letter for this to work. Now, let's just say if this happens, we will say hello. Now, it's time to test it. S-T-E-A-M And look at that guys! It worked! I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to watch 10 other scratch acts, the link will be on screen now.